Her girl. <laughs> so welcome back to my channel. I'm just being dramatic. <laughs> oh, my camera is dark. I don't know. But anyways, we're just gonna be all the way. I just wanted for the record that I have my max one, like so that when I come back to look at this video someday, sometime, I'll remember that there was a time that there was this fiasco going on in the world. <laughs> Alright, so yeah. Welcome back to my channel. How are you guys doing? How is everything with you guys? I hope you guys are all staying safe and prayerful. Most important, prayerful. Anyways, guys, so let me just get into today's video. First of all, guys, let me just tell you, I'm just coming back from work and I'm happy. Alright, so first of all, I just wanted to tell you guys that you can see the time. This is almost 6 o'clock. So yeah, I'm just coming back from work and I'm grateful. I'll be talking about something exciting already. You, you know from the title of the video, you already know. But it's it's really something of, um, it's nice. And I was like saying the good things that you observe in your environment and everything. So yeah, that's the reason why I want to open up to you guys and just tell you how amazing some places that you're living in it was last week tuesday last week tuesday i get it right so it was last week tuesday that this happened so i'm still gonna put it on the screen so that you will see though i'm gonna shade some parts just for privacy sake or whatever but yeah so um let me just read it then i'll now explain so the it was sent with turkish language i translated it so it's gonna be here so you, you see so let me just read ministry of labor and social security is a dash there reserve fund department so the cents i'm not going to talk the amount but it's reasonable um empl employment support payment has been sent to your bank account submitted in the application statement if this sms has been received by you please ignore it so basically this SMS was coming directly from the Ministry of Labor and Security and Social Security. Then the department is reserved fund department. So this is just like Ministry of Edu um, Education. This is just like Ministry of Labor. But the main word they say that is there Ministry of Labor and Social Security slash the department precisely is from Reserve Fund Department. So guys, guess what? <laughs> Cause let me just I like gist and I think you guys like my gist anyways. But today the camera is dark. Anyways, let me just go. So <laughs> normally um we've gotten to the end of the month, okay? So um there was no money and sent to our account like payments. Already you guys knew that we didn't work. Okay, let me just backtrack. We stopped working second week of March. That was on a Saturday. We stopped working. So I would say for March, we worked to, um, in the, the two weeks. We worked in the two weeks. Then the remaining two weeks, we didn't work. There was no work. That is when the, the lockdown started that Saturday. All right. So then the whole April, we didn't work. So um, April, we paid, they paid us, and um, our company paid us our. Uh, um, what they call it wages salary whatever they paid us okay but the whole april now um is so clear that we didn't work nobody came to work the whole of april so there was just like a speculation maybe they're going to pay maybe the company is going to pay or maybe the government is going to pay all things so the normal time that our company used to pay us came and passed so <laughs> so, you know so um they didn't pay then we started hearing that all oh, is um because we have insurance like every worker has insurance so we started hearing that uh oh, they're gonna pay is from government that will pay us and everything coming from the kind of country that i'm coming from my, back in my home country like to be serious with you guys i didn't really bother thinking but the truth and honest part of me was like I couldn't understand that so April I will not receive any money that was my concern but I wasn't really deep into like um, 
expecting government to pay i want i was expecting our company to pay not government you, you understand you understand what i'm trying to say so the day okay you know the weekend now fell the end of the month it fell till weekend and it was first of may and everything so it was a joking thing in our house because my husband would just keep my husband would just keep laughing at me and laughing at me that she just removed my mind <laughs> from that morning that she just removed my mind that did i walk I didn't work and I'm looking for money and all those things there. So at the point I became angry and I was like, if they pay any money, I'm gonna collect that your money since you because literally he didn't even bother, like he didn't even think about such. Alright, so the most funny thing was on Monday. That was the start of work. That's fourth of May when North Cyprus um, resumed work. So everybody was just like obviously they're gonna pay this Monday. That I'm going to pay a price salary this Monday, and the day started. Lunch, evening, we went back. Oh, that day, my husband laughed me. Oh my god! Like, as in, <laughs> if I was a child, I would have been crying. He was just laughing, 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 laughing. But we're still hearing that government will pay, government will pay, government will pay. Obviously, it's not going to be the full payment, like one month payment, but they're going to give us something. So, okay. Imagine the funny thing. On Tuesday, that was the 5th. On Tuesday, um, everything finished. Work even closed. We closed from work that day. <laughs> that was 5.30. So obviously me, I just told myself that since this month, as in I was hoping on Monday. So it didn't happen that Monday. I was like, okay, that's fine. It's gone. No problem. I didn't walk in from the country that I'm coming from. You don't even expect so. So I was just like, okay, I'm fine. That one has passed. Is the Corona, Corotin. Okay, let's just accept it and everything. So getting back home, I wanted to start editing my video that was the, the video that I did uh, the first day of work. So my mom was just like, Wow, there is a lot to blah, 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 blah. I was like, please just stop killing me and everything. Now I get to my phone. He brought his phone that I was showing me. I went to my account. I was like, wow. They paid like let me just call it half of our salary. So they paid us half of the salary. Not really half, like a little bit, like but let me just call it half. But it's not how how will I say it? Okay, a little bit close to half. That let me just say maybe 300 TA uh, add, add, adding to it or 250. But the thing is that to most people it might be half, so let's just say half of the salary they paid us. Man, man, <laughs> man, it was amazing like getting that huge amount of money without working is crazy, it's crazy. So, um, like. I was just like, I just, I just like thinking from where I'm coming from, precisely Nigeria, and hearing the stuff that they are doing, cutting workers, they are shutting um, the staff, cutting the workers, sacking so many people, doing so many things, lockdown and everything. And I come to think about this small country, just this small country. As in just looking out for their people. First of all, they they, they they really, 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 really contained this um coro thing. As in they were just like the things that you don't even think that will happen is just happening in this North Cyprus, to be honest, to be honest, to be really honest. Like they came through this season, they came through. I heard somebody told me that um people that have children like young kids and all that they they if you ask they will send you um pampers food i know about a number but i didn't really want to talk about it because i'm, I'm definitely not going to do it and yeah so that's why i didn't want to talk about it. there was a number that you have to call if you call they will ask you how many people are you in the place they'll bring the amount of food for all of you guys you just call a number just like calling 911 but, but I, we weren't interested because we know we're not going to use that source okay so yeah so um i'm just like so blown away being paid without working as a nigeria like is unheard of and like you as in guys it's so excited like i've not touched that money i just be, i've just been looking at the money like i was like for real 
without paying half of my salary like almost half of my salary like is amazing then hearing that nigeria they are just doing the opposite of everything is crazy it's just so crazy like i don't care what anybody will say but the thing here is that i don't really go deep into this kind of issue but sometimes you just have to say it like i don't know like okay let me just tell you there's one day during last week my mom was just telling me the condition of how nigeria is guys it's terrible it's terrible everything is hard everything is hard like the lockdown that we're seeing abroad here is so 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 different from the lockdown in nigeria precisely let me just use nigeria that i know very well like there is nothing you can count nothing everything is hard everything is hard in that country and the truth be told is that if you've ever stayed outside the country you cannot go back to that country i don't know anybody that would want to go to that country. if you if you even people that have decided to go back to that country at the end of the day is either they kidnap them or they kill them so to be honest there's nothing to hide about but it's just that things just needs to change but me hopefully as in, in my mind though i'm not just gonna lie i don't think it's gonna change but let's just hope it to change but i i i have zero 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 um optimistic about that I'm, i i don't think so so i just don't want to bore you bore you with this this is a very great news so for some people that are wondering oh how is cyprus how is the system how is everything this could just tell you like this is how cyprus is is it security everywhere is just so safe like i keep saying to my channel it's just like cyprus is not part of the world because how things are the security wise like everything not like generally everything but to an extent is somewhere somebody can breathe not necessarily calling your home if i don't know how i don't know how to explain but the thing is that you can breathe if you want to breathe so yeah so this is me guys i don't want to go long so this is me guys just explaining as in what had happened and uh, we got paid me and my husband but he's still owing me that money because i've not collected his own money so we got paid without working from the government and they sent it direct to our bank account which was amazing and everything so guys for all of you that are thinking of um relocating to north cyprus and everything you just have to do your research look out for things that you, that are of concern to you if that applies to north cyprus you can um move over or make it as a stepping stone but life in general is very much okay than um where i'm coming from so before i end this video i don't know they might watch me they don't you, you never can tell people that are watching so i just want to say thank you to north cyprus government thank you for remembering us <laughs> thank you for your um reserve fund support thank you for um locking down the stuff and everything is god that did everything everything god is the baba of everything thank you god for everything thank you jesus for everything yeah so i just want to say thank you north cyprus for your help that you're showing to us showing to every people if you go if you watch um north cyprus vloggers you will hear some people they give they gave them bags of food like cattle of food different different things inside so thank you for all the good things that you do giving children die pass and everything thank you thank you thank you you really came through this season and god almighty that we serve will bless not cyprus that is how i'm going to end this video i'm going to see you guys in my next one bye <laughs>